what's up? What happened to P Prime Minister Justin Trudeau's LGBTQ, and that's, I'm not going to say the whole alphabet soup number, action plan? Whatever happened to that? $100 million last August 28th, he announced he was spending $100 million to promote the LGBTQ plus agenda. What happened to that money? Well, you know, it's being used against parents who don't want their children exposed to gender ideology in the schools. Did you know that? Yes. Contract was awarded to a company that is going to put together a plan to attack hateful parents who don't want their children exposed to the crap that's going on in our school system. So tax, their taxpayer dollars are being used against them. And they're being labeled as hateful because they think their children should at least be telling them if they want to change their gender or think they want to change their gender. Or the school decides they can change their gender. These parents are demanding their rights. This is not hateful. This is being a good parent. And the Trudeau government is using taxpayer dollars to persecute them, to go after them, and to malign them as hateful. What else is the money being used for in this $100 million fund? Well, it's, it's just called a purge fund at some points, and you have to look at the website to believe this. This is incredible what is going on. They, they are spending money on choral events, singing about the supposed purge of LGBTQ people from the civil service, from the military, from the RCMP. They're spending money to help people explore queer history. They're spending money on an LGBTQ monument in Winnipeg. And on told other thing we're just discovering where this money is because it's not all listed on the website it's in pieces here there and everywhere and we're we are just discovering how bad this is but this is why there's a constant flow of propaganda because the trudeau government is funding it they're financing this constant flow of propaganda hello rainbow railroad <laughs> happy pride season and that's why we continue to see this. Hi, it's David Creighton there. Thank you so much for subscribing and supporting the station. We could not move forward without you. What we're trying to do every week here is bring you the news you might not see everywhere else. And we're coming against Justin Trudeau's internet censorship laws. Please subscribe, ring that bell if you haven't done so already. I know it's annoying to ask. Believe me, I'm not a salesman. <laughs> I'm a writer. But I really implore you to do that because I need this station to keep going. We want to keep bringing you the news that you want to hear. And if you want a story covered, let me know, please. Because that's where I'm getting a lot of news information from your tips. So thank you for being there for me. And you can also support this station by going on my Substacks and subscribing for $8 a month. Yes, I know it's free, but I, I can also use your support. So please do that if you can. And I will continue to be here every week. Every day, if I'm, if must needs be, to tell you what's really happening in this world of ours. And I'm in nobody's pocket. But I am on your side.